everyone. Today, I will be showing you um, how to set up your store on Shopee. Okay, so um, assuming you have a Shopee consumer account, a personal account that you want to also use um, as a seller. But if you do not want to use your personal account as a seller, you will need to use another mobile number. Okay, another mobile number as well as email address to set up account. So for Shopee, um, you can use the same account to shop as well as to sell. Whereas for Lazada, the seller account and the shopper account are two different things altogether. Okay, so I'm now logged in into my personal um, uh, account, okay, where I buy things on Shopee. Yeah? And I'm going to use this to do a demo on how to how to sell or set up your store on Shopee. So um, if you go to um, this uh, Shopee.sg, you will see here over here, um, okay, you can do sell on Shopee or you can go to Seller Center. Uh, I'll guys just go straight to Seller Center because I have already um, logged in. Okay, so I'll go straight to Seller Center here. So it's over here. So I, okay, so welcome to Shopee. Yeah? And then I start registration. Okay. Um, um, shop name. Run away SG. Okay. Uh, all right. Okay. Submit. Yes. Go to add product. So it's so fast, right? You just add your shop name and email. Uh, but I before that, let me. Uh, this is the app product category. So it will just direct you um to the app product um page. But you uh, may not want to go straight to app product page. Huh? Let's go back to home for the Shopee Seller Center. Okay, uh, you can close this pop up. So this is your home page now. And uh, this is how it looks. Okay, let me just take you through how it is on the Shopee back end. Now, uh, so the first one, okay, so there is this um shipping setting, my shipment, mesh ship and shipping setting. Okay, so um for the shipping, right? Okay, so these are the um standard delivery for local. And for Shopee Express, GNT Express, Ninja Van, and Speed Post, right? Um, you will not be able to use the pickup option if you have less than five parcels a day, five orders a day, rather. So, um, meaning you have to drop off your parcel if you are using uh, these four um, providers. You have to drop off your parcel somewhere. Um, they will give you the address and then you can, you know, uh, send, send it out by dropping off. Huh? Now, let's see. Okay. Find out how to sign up for other channels over here. Okay. So, um, there is this integrated Shopee supported logistics. And then there is the other um, logistics provider. Okay. So uh, for other logistics provider, right, the non-integrated ones, you need to have valid reasons to use them, okay? Um, for example, like um, you parcel, you parcel as well as um, there is another one. I can't remember, but some of these um, providers, they actually help you to transport, um, chew frozen or perishable items, okay? Seller's own fleet delivery, uh, meaning you, um, for some reason, maybe you need to install the, the product or it's too bulky. So the seller will have to uh, register, you know, to be able to deliver on your own. You may also apply for um, store pickup or you may, okay, you may also sell um, virtual goods, okay. So to use the non-integrated shipping channels, okay, please submit an application, all right. Okay, so um, the you parcel is one of them. Okay, available to selected sellers. Okay, so yeah, so this is for the shipping settings. Yeah. Mm, okay. Now um, over here, this is where you can see your orders. Okay, when they come in, and you may manage your orders from here as well. Okay, confirm. And then uh, this will be where you can upload your products, okay, and manage your products. There's also a marketing center. 
this is where you manage your promotions, create vouchers, um, as well as join um, Shopee campaigns. There is also Shopee ads that you may want to check it out to help your products um, gain more visibility. Okay, and then you have the finance. This is where you um, see your um, uh, earnings as well as how much is deducted uh, from your earnings. You do have some data, but currently because the store has no sales at all, no products, so there's no data. Okay, on growth. So the next step from this marketplace, right, would be preferred seller. Um, if you are a brand, you may choose to register for Shopee Mall. Okay, so if you want to register for Shopee Mall, go ahead to click on sell on Shopee. Okay, and then over here, um, you can actually start selling on this um, Shopee Mall. Okay. Now, where else? Okay. For customer service, we have the chat assistant and FAQ assistant. Um, you may uh, include an FAQ in your chat. Or, okay, or you can chat with your, uh, this is where you chat. Okay, so where you chat with your, um, the other sellers that you're buying products from and where you chat with your own buyers will be the same window. Huh? Okay, shop. Okay, so over here, you can actually decorate your shop. So you have a very um, nice looking front. Okay, and you can also create your own categories within your shop. Media space is where you can um, upload your videos as well as your product images. Settings, uh, my address here, shop settings. Let me go through this. Okay, got it. Okay, so um, you can have vocation mode, allow SMS as additional account verification method if you want. Mm, okay, now um, private settings, chat settings. Okay, allow negotiations. Okay. Mm, so we should disallow. Huh? And then the uh, notification settings for order updates or listing updates or personalized content. Okay, um, what else is there? Okay, my address here is account partner platform. Okay, that's about all I I want to show you. So this is um generally how your back end is going to look like. Okay. So for the next video, I will uh probably do um maybe the first product listing and and then if you have any questions uh, also that you would like me to demonstrate, do a live demo on Shopee, back end, please feel free to, um, you know, put down in the comment section. And then I'll be so happy to, you know, to help to show you. Okay, so yeah, that is all. Thank you for watching.